Good evening, YouTube. You guys are now watching another segment with the Cali Effect. Today, I'm here with Leo Playstrong. Mr. Boulders! And unfortunately, um, D Fish Fan wasn't here to make it. Um, I was told that Mr. Smuffin got to him, and you guys know what happened there. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord, Mr. Smuffin got him. I can't believe oh, 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 He's been with a gang. Okay. I think, anyways. I think the gang sons in Acorn. Anyways. We're going to be talking about Constellar for Spotlight Saturday. Overall, I really think this is a pretty much underappreciated deck now. I've grown some respect from it after I've played it, you know, for a couple of more hours and fixed up a little with consistency issues. Is there anything you think about it? I think deck is pretty good when you go uh, first and apply to set four back or say go. Yeah, and two of those four back rows, I don't know, Vanity's Emptiness. And Maybe a safe zone. Safe zone and... You know, you're just, one of Just fuck you. Yeah, just, just basically like that. That dino rabbit effect. Oh, special summon? Emptiness. On oh, my turn, bounce emptiness. And now what? Now what? Real nigga, what's up? Basically, that's what that deck really says. Overall, just a pretty jerkish type deck. Uh, I think the only problem that, that it's ever had was consistency issues, and that was my only beef with this deck. Inconsistency issues, just... um. Hard, hard times getting out Plighties. Keep in mind, it is a rank 5. All of your Constellar monsters that you play in the deck are rank 4. So the only way to make it is through costs. And he is a little searchable, but then you don't have enough Constellar base to use it with. Can you please define what you mean by base, Mr. Effect? Well, you have your 3 Somberish, your 3 Pulix, um, your 3 costs. And you run your two or three Algaide. That's not enough monsters to support a full Constellar engine. If we maybe had one more Constellar card that was at least decent, I don't know, if it was a searcher, it'd be amazing. But if it was a level four Constellar monster that was a searcher, maybe, this deck would be tier one. I really think this deck would be the jerk deck of all time. The jerk deck of first implied set for back or Sega? Sounds like laggy if you ask me. What about first turn lag set for back or say go? Yeah, so, I mean, do you guys get that right there? First turn Lagia, first turn Plyties. Pretty jerkish right there. And he's emptiness. I'm, I'm seeing another Dino Rabbit format. Uh, basically, it's a Dino Rabbit deck. Um, the difference between... The only difference between Lagia and this card is that this card is way more broken. Bouncing in a... Bouncing a card, period. A to card. Your hand. And you have two material. During either player's turn is a little more broken than just negating a spell trap or summon. Just a little bit. Especially when my back row is namely just to protect a 2500 beater at worst. And then after your end phase, I'm going to bounce whatever you just said. Yeah, I'm going to bounce what you just said. I'm, I'm going to bounce this, bounce that, make another Plyties, and then I'm going to go for game. Gorse? Oh, we'll just bounce it. <laughs> no, just, I'll let you have your Gorse back. It's okay. <laughs> it's it's alright. I'm going for game right now. I'll bounce your token, I'll bounce your Gorse. You won't get it back. Bye bye. Good game. Really just dumb. Yeah. The um, deck is uh, it's pretty good. I played it. I played it one time. I've never touched a deck before. Played it and I loved it. Damn, really? Yeah, the deck's actually pretty good. Oh, well, if you want to have everything DT in the binder, we'll definitely get to that later. I'll give you a dollar for it. A doll hair or a dollar? Doll hair. I'll pay you in bits of string. What kind of doll hair? Bits of string. But no, I want a doll hair. Uh, Barbie. No, I don't want a bar black Barbie or white Barbie. Black Barbie. Who said I want a black Barbie? I want a model. Or a white Barbie. You Now, which white Barbie do I want? 2007 model. No, I want Darcy. I, mean, I don't know what's more scary. The fact that you know <laughs> multiple Barbie names. <laughs> As a black man, we all love them white girls. But thank you guys for watching another segment of the Cali Effect. Please like, comment, subscribe. But most of all, enjoy.